the difference between CrossFit and I guess you could say your typical gym is that we are striving and and clawing for progression in movement and in health and in intensity. So we have a bond over that too. If I walked into, back in the day, if I were to walk into the Globo gym and uh, have my headphones in, I didn't know anybody around me, maybe one or two people. You know, I, uh, I didn't know their job. I didn't know their family. I didn't know what they did after they did the gym. Whereas you come in here and, I mean, as the owner, I know everybody's name. I know their family's name. I know their kids' sports. I know uh, their occupations. So I think there's a, a huge uh, connection that people feel with each other here. So we, we're a family. That's what it is. That's the big divider between us and everyone else. In my opinion, well, the real definition of CrossFit is constantly varied functional movement at a high intensity. And really what that means is that it's it's almost a blueprint for the optimal uh, level of fitness. Uh, if you could think of the most, or the fittest person you could possibly be, the way we train to get to that way is CrossFit. That's constantly varied functional movement. Uh, to really sum it up, it's a process of bettering yourself. The people that come to CrossFit um, at Cloud9 are unique in the sense that it's everybody. It is your your middle-aged mom who's never picked up a weight in her life. It's the overweight um, person who you know has insecurities about trying to do something new in front of fit people. It's your former professional athlete who's come in here and trying to um, still have that competitive edge and being fittest person they can be it's everybody is coming in here some maybe with different goals but everybody is still working together and that's one of the things that make it make it so special here is that it's such a unique demographic it's it's like a family atmosphere it's, it's we're all coming together we're all cheering each other on and really it's more of it's 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 more of a club than a gym really i mean we're all in it you know we're all together in it too it is a community of itself. We always ch tend to chase goals, regardless if we get them or not. I feel like the atmosphere is already laid back, but serious at the same time. So, you know, you could have somebody that's never done it before come in through the doors, and after the workout, they feel like they know everybody. They love the fact that we're cheering for them. Um, you get to know people just from talking to them during a class. Like, as a coach, I love that. Oh my God, if, you know what, I think everybody on some level has been affected by it. You know, we have a couple that combined and have lost over 500 pounds. We've seen people better themselves outside the gym in their relationships at work. Um, we have teenagers that are building confidence, you know, helping squander insecurities and starting to boost their self-esteem. I mean, those things are priceless. You can't cannot put a number on it. It's changed my life in every way. I really do have more energy than I did before. Um, I, I even sleep better than I did before. Um, I'm off of any types of uh, medication that I used to be on. Uh, just every aspect of my life has been improved because of this. I think um, everybody, if you don't see it on the surface, is definitely being affected on some level of what this place has done. There's no doubt in my mind what CrossFit has done. Yeah. If you're going to start CrossFit for the first time, the hardest part is walking through the doors the first time. Period. There's nothing else that's more difficult to get by. Once you start your first class, and you get that monkey off your back, everything else just falls into place. The workouts suck, but you have you know a whole gym full of people that are gonna be pulling you through that with you and making sure that you're getting through it. I think the biggest thing is people that are new to CrossFit is you know the first couple of weeks are hard, 
you know, it's hard to come into a gym and be the new person. Um, we've all been there di in different phases, different things in our lives. Even from when we're a child, going to the first soccer game or first soccer practice, you're walking and you don't know anybody. Um, the thing about CrossFit is, is when you walk into that gym, people are excited to see you. They're seeing someone walking in and they were that person. It could have been three days ago, it could have been three years ago. So we all know what that's like. And I think that's one of the things that makes CrossFit so amazing is we've all been there. So we're here to help each other out. Keep coming. It gets better. It gets easier. And after only a few months, it uh, almost becomes like it's necessary, like that kind of a release that you need. Um, and everything about your life will improve, inside and outside of the gym. The biggest argument I have with newer athletes is I'm not in shape enough to do CrossFit. And it just blows me away because that's the whole point of this place is to get in shape. It's not to, it's not this place of the elite. And I wish people could see that because everyone here is just trying to be better. Their ability is all over the spectrum, but we're just striving to be better. So no matter where you are, you're gonna fall the spectrum somewhere with a bunch of other people that are already here. I think that my favorite part is the uh, definitely the people. You come in, you have fun, you laugh a lot, and uh, we kind of joke around. And then once the clock beeps, it's business. You know, everybody is trying their best. Everyone is is uh, helping each other out. We're pushing each other. And then once it beeps uh, and it ends, we're all laying on the floor. We're high fiving, and then we're back to laughter and, and good times. So. The people make this place what it is. They make CrossFit what it is.